Brother Terrell is like that fire bearer. When our little lights go out, we have to come to these kind of meetings, you know, <laughs> and then stick our little stick to that big torch. Is that right? Hey, Amen. And then take that fire back to our churches, back to our places. And I thank God that we have that kind of word, don't you? Praise the Lord. I really appreciate the Lord. Thank God for all the, the meeting that's so far every service to me. I've been telling folks that look like these services are climbing. It's the one thing about this kind of ministry. I've never seen this ministry go backwards. It's always been going forward. God said go forward, didn't he? And the word and the revelation of the word that God has given Brother Terrell, it just takes us higher and higher. And I'm believing one day somebody going to possess that ministry of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. I want to be one of them, don't you? Praise God. We, we, we do thank God. I really appreciate the Lord for the opportunities the Lord have been giving us to be able to travel with Brother Terrell. We don't take that for granted because um, I feel like myself to be working with, if I was a boxer, I would, I would love to be working with somebody like uh, Floyd Mayweather Jr. if I was a lightweight boxer because they're, they're, the, they're the best in their league. You understand what I'm saying? Or if I was a basketball player, I would like to be playing with somebody like Kobe Bryant or, or, or running with somebody like Michael Jordan to, to copy those skills. To, to get to, you know, somebody that, 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 that's good at a field, they'll make people around them play better. Well, to me, Brother Terrell, is, he, he's, he's the best in his field right now. <laughs> he's the best in his field. And to be able to travel with him and see how the Lord uses him to be able to handle mass crowds. I mean, crowds of people that I know it would be impossible for somebody who don't have the experience, the wisdom, and even God in their lives to be able to handle. Because in, in big mobs like that, that you can easily start a riot by just saying the wrong thing. But God has anointed Brother Terrell with wisdom and, and, and have given him that, that anointing to be able to go out there in a few moments of a time, captivate, you know, sometime a, a half a million people. And can you imagine a crowd of half a million people and, and nobody saying nothing? Everybody's listening with, 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 with all of their heart at the words that come out of the mouth of the man of God. And I said, God, I said, many of us as preachers and, and laymen, people who want to do something, we need this kind of experience. We need, we need to see this man in action as God uses him to deliver his, the word and to bring healing and deliverance to God's people. I remember uh, just uh, here recently, we was over there in Africa, and as he was preaching, the Holy Ghost began to fall and people was being baptized while he was preaching. The anointing was so powerful. I called Brother Blue back. I said, Brother Blue, I said, I've never heard the man of God preach like God is using him to preach now with such an anointing, with such a power coming out of his little body. Amen. And, and the, the, the crowd was just absorbing that anointing and absorbing that Jesus that he was preaching. And it was about maybe a, uh, 70 or 80,000 people there. And when he got ready to call for uh, maybe the deaf mutes and different ones to come up to pray, people started running out of the audience and somebody picked up a wheelchair and started walking with it. So others held up uh, 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 crutches and started walking. And this one lady came up out of the crowd and she walked up on the platform. She was real weak looking. And she stood in front of Brother Terrell and she said, I'm healed. And it said, okay. She said, I'm healed. I'm healed. She said, cancer, I'm healed. And before she could finish trying to explain what was happening, her, her daddy came up and said, this is my daughter. She had been sick and, uh, and dying from cancer, but the Lord has healed her. But before he could finish and get it all explained, the mother came up and said, no, 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 you don't understand. He said, she said, I have been carrying her on my back for three years to the bathroom and back to the bed. For three years, I've carried her. She could not walk. She was dying from cancer, but Jesus has made her whole. Oh, hallelujah. 
That type of anointing, that type of wisdom, praise God, is what I'm talking about. To see how God can use a man to bring healing and deliverance to people that don't even have, don't even know the name of Jesus. And I said, God, I said, it's like giving, it's like a real doctor when he's giving somebody a shot. You know, a, a good nurse to talk to you. I seen, I had a nurse one time, man, she just pop you. She don't care whether you be ready or not. She just pop you. But a good nurse to talk to you and get you ready. Well, that's what God has been using Brother Terrell to do with this message of Jesus. He gets people ready to inject that healing and to inject that word into their hearts. And I do appreciate being a part of that 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 this kind of revival i want you to prepare yourself today as as the man of god prepares himself to come he is not just here preaching a service preaching revivals but god is injecting something in you and i something is taking place in our hearts and in our lives this joy that you feel is not just an outward thing it's something happening on the inside we want you to stand on your feet today we want you to continue to hunger and reach out and thirst as god uses his servant at this time to bring forth his word whether it be through prophecy whether it be through preaching what however God uses him people of God it is for our benefit stretch your hand this way and receive a man the brother Terrell have preached face to face to more people than any man alive to me he's a legend in his own time he's God sent he's God's servant brother David Terrell thank you Holy Father